this clip we're going to go over just one different type of repair. Um, this stand-up surfboard is actually 11 foot 6 and you know most surfboards are about 6 feet long somewhere in between there if you've got a long board you know generally you won't find anything much bigger than about you know 9 to 10 feet. Stand-ups are running now from like 9 all the way up to about 14 feet long. Some of the longer distance ones are even up to about 18 to 19 feet but those are like Laird Hamilton out in Hawaii going from island to island that's crazy. Um, but these boards are huge. They're lighter than they look, but they got to be really buoyant and they're hard to maneuver around with. So you're going to get a lot of cosmetic stuff like scratches on the rails and you know, you're going to see people dragging them a lot if they're being used all the time. So one big thing that happens is when you're getting in and out of the water, you can see right here on the bottom, a lot of the kids that we uh, sort of use these boards with have been just dragging them once they get out of the water. And this is fine right here. All it's done is basically taken off the top layer of paint and um, you know we'll get a nice sort of cream off-white colored paint we'll paint right back over this and it's good but if you allow this to happen long enough um, eventually this is going to get really down into the fibers you can see it's almost started to so what you're going to do in that event is you know use a piece of fiberglass cloth like this and use the appropriate resin composites and you'll actually put another layer of fiberglass on it and uh, we're not going to do it quite yet because we're about to put this guy in the water but pretty much just like you see right here you're gonna add this on put the resin over it wait for it to dry and then sand out the sides around it you know put that off-white coat over it and boom your board is good as new ready to rock